Hi guys, going by Nicole's Eyes back with another video. This video is an intro for Nightmare on Panning Street. It goes from October 22nd, 2022 to October 2023. And the creators are Shaylin and Valerie. And this is a Fantastic Ladies collab. I will try and link their channels in the description and the Fantastic Ladies collab. So, yeah. Shall we get started on the video? Okay. We are going to spin for six prompts. Okay, Exorcism of Emily Rose. There are, I think, 39 prompts to this project. And I gotta flip around and hunt for that one. She's here someplace. Um. Anyway. That is number 35. Okay, we got five more spins. Children of the Corn. Gotta find that one. Children of the Corn. One of my favorite movies. One of my favorite movies. Right along with Pet Cemetery. And that one is 16. Let's see. I think that's two we did. Double checking. Ah. Dang. Look. Yep, two. So we have four more spins. The Invisible Man. Um, number six. So we have three more spins. Get out. I don't know what kind of movie that was, but we have Get Out, and then we have two more spins. That is number 28, and we have two more spins. Paranormal Activity. Yeah, it's here somewhere. There's just so many prompts. Eh? I have to find them all. And then we have one more prompt to spin, I think. It's number 17. I think we have one last spin. I think. I'll go back and count them. A Quiet Place. Number four. Okay, that's one. It's 
one, two, three. Oops. Three. Four, five. One, two, three, four, five. We have one more. We have one more spin. Ugh. If I wouldn't drop everything. Rosemary's baby. I gotta find her. <laughs> right here, number 31. All right. There's all of our spins. So now I'm gonna go through each and every prompt with you. A Quiet Place, a product that makes you speechless. The Invisible Man, something that erases primer, concealer, foundation. Or powder. Huh. Oh, that's like, yeah, okay. Children of the Corn, a food-related item, name, shape, or scent. Just the pages in this book are sticking together. Get Out, a product you want to get out of your collection. Rosemary's Baby, an item in your collection. A new item in your collection. The Exorcism of Emily Rose, an item that makes you levitate on cloud nine. And those are all the prompts, and I will be back with all my products. Okay, guys, I'm really confused on this project because I rolled in so many and I'm not sure. I think I I think I think rolled seven times, but I'm not sure. The Invisible Man is something that erases concealer, foundation, and powder. I rolled in these Be Pure Makeup Wipes from Dollar Tree for 10 uses. Oh, wait. That's not even the first one. Oh, I don't think. No. A Quiet Place. A product that makes you speechless. Okay. I chose this Viseart eyeshadow primer. Sorry for all the shutoffs of, of the camera, but I'm trying to figure this out. Okay, that was number one. Okay, the Invisible Man, something that erases primer, concealer, foundation. I rolled in these, these Be Pure Makeup Wipes for 10 uses. So that's number two. Children of the Corn, a food-related item, name, shape, or scent. I rolled in this moisturizing liquid lipstick for five uses. Paranormal Activity, a new item that never seems to disappear. I chose this perfume. This is a generic for um, one of JLo's scents. I chose that for ten uses. Ok, 
okay? Get out a product, a product you want to get out of your collection. Well, I don't really, not really sure that I have any of those. And I put in this blush, Wet n Wild Pearlescent Pink for 10 uses. So I rolled that in. Rosemary's Baby. A new item in your collection. I chose this um, LA Colors Beauty Pot. You guys seen what it looks like? It's like a single eyeshadow if you rub them all together. So I chose that for 10 uses because it's fairly new to my collection. I got it last time I did a live stream and did a Dollar Tree testing Dollar Tree makeup. And then I got Rose the Exorcism of Emily Rose. An item that makes you levitate on cloud nine. I chose this. Must be the sixth one. I chose this Wet n Wild Fergie eyeshadow primer because I love this guy. And I think that's why it's been in my collection for so long. I, it's got some use, yes, but I just, I really love this and it's still smells good and it still works like a charm and it's very takes a very long time to uh to use up an eyeshadow primer so yeah i chose that guy for 10 uses Sorry about all the shutoffs <laughs> on the camera. Okay, that, there we go. There's all my six items. <laughs> we got it right on this time, so thumbs up. Alrighty, so that's all I have for you guys for today. I hope you all really enjoy the video. Remember, Makeup is to be fun so that you can feel pretty beautiful and confident. And I'll talk to you guys in the next one. Bye.